Oh yes, subscribe to the Buzz UG and uh, don't forget to hit the bell for all the notifications. My name is Fula and I'm welcoming you to this other story that I'm bringing to you right now. Those in the diaspora, we appreciate you for being there and kindly subscribe to the Buzz UG so that you can actually get to understand what is happening in Uganda, in the entertainment industry, the current affairs and everything that is happening around. Now, you know it very well that uh, up to now, we haven't confirmed where Fred Lumbu is very many people are still questioning where is the man is he still in turkey or he's in uganda already but you also remember the other day uh the minister of foreign affairs or keloriam came out and said that the man is being brought to uganda and up to now we have never heard about him yeah we have never heard about him we don't know if he's in uganda or he's still the other side of turkey you know we have received reports on social media showing that uh Lumbuye is in Gulu district at the military base in Gulu. But, the, you know, these are reports that haven't been confirmed. I did see, you know, some bloggers the other day on TV saying or confirming it that uh, the man is in Gulu. But definitely we are waiting. Now, uh, finally, uh, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, that is uh, Okelo Oriem, has come out to say that uh, Lumbuye is in safe hands. Wherever he is, he believes that uh, he's okay and nothing wrong is happening on him. Lum Lum Lumbuye, Lumbuye is alive. Uh, as uh, as far as I know, Lumbuye, uh, these people should not be worried about uh, Lumbuye and uh, the, uh, the relevant authorities uh, who have Lumbuye will, the, the, will, will at the right time be able to uh, uh, bring Lumbuye in public and bring him before the court of law. I don't think that Lumbuye should be made a martyr or should be made somebody who is so, so important as, as a film star. And uh, the, the Lumbuye's human rights are being respected absolutely wherever he is, mm. I am sure. So there's nothing for people to worry about uh, Lumbuye. People should go around uh, trying to look for their survival. Mm. They should work hard to look after the family and they should work hard to make sure that their, their household income increases and they should not worry about but, uh, there are you. many more things uh, in Uganda which is more important uh, for yourself and your family than to worry about Lumbuye. Yes, that is uh, Okelo Oriem. But my question is, why don't you bring this man to the courts of law? If he did something wrong, if he has a crime, why don't you bring him to the courts of law so that he can be charged? Why are you holding him wherever he is? And to me, actually, uh, this guy's statement shows me that... Um, Lumbuye could be in Uganda right here. I don't know how you feel about, you know, this guy's statement. You know, some people were saying that uh, he's being tortured or something like that. They're trying to, first of all, get information from him before they bring him to the courts of law. That's what people have been saying. And that could be true, my friend. The way this guy is talking, you know, the guy could be in the country right here in Gulu. But of course, as the Buzz UG, uh, we cannot confirm that. But wherever he is, we really pray for him and we hope that he will come out very safe and sound, okay? Um, Moving away from that, uh, very many people have been asking what Pastor Wilson Bugembe thinks about marriage. We have seen, uh, you know, different women come out boldly uh, saying that uh, they want to marry Pastor Wilson Bugembe. Uh, the other day, some woman said Simanya, the Holy Spirit, told her Wilson Bugembe is the, you know, is the man she's supposed to get married to. Eh, never nange this gender. <laughs> it is so amusing. Anyway, uh, the latest we are gathering from uh, Pastor Wilson Bugembe's camp shows that, uh, you know, he has been planning his introduction ceremony since January this year. Yes, the introduction ceremony is on and uh, everything is moving on so well. Actually, the source told us that uh, his lover is called Friday. Yes, she's called Friday. Uh, we don't know the second name yet or we don't know other names yet. But for now, we can confirm that uh, Pastor Wilson Bugembe's lover is called Friday and she lives in Canada. It is not that she's uh, a Muzungu. I think she's a Ugandan, but she lives the other side of Canada. Yes, they have been together uh, since last year. Yes, since last year. And uh, we have been told that uh, the families of these two people are busy getting prepared as the wedding dates are being set for early next year. So early next year, uh, get ready for Pastor Wilson's introduction ceremony happening early next year. That one, we can confirm it.
Now, according to the source, actually Friday, the lava will be in the country in October this year. So when she finally gets into the country, definitely we shall keep you posted. Yeah, we shall give you that info. But in his own words, the source told us that uh, it is only known to a few of us, but uh, he's preparing his introduction ceremony. Uh, Friday will be in the country in October this year. Uh, the relationship started last year and will be sealed in January. Yes, yeah, so that is what is coming from uh, Pastor Wood and Bugembe's camp and we will keep you posted for all the developments but for now what we got to say to Pastor Wilson Bugembe is congratulations oh congratulations man of God yeah man we are happy for you and we wish you all the best we wish you all the best we just can't wait for that ceremony that will be early next year yes that is the latest kindly subscribe to the Buzz UG don't forget to hit the bell for all the notifications comment like and share our stories to your friends and family my name is Fula. Thank you.